of stuff you would get like in a spring roll. You say there, a little dipping sauce. It's like a, a meat spring roll. Does that make sense? Like a bean spurt in there? Yeah, it's lame. <laughs> What's up soldiers? Don't forget to click subscribe if you've already clicked subscribe. Hit that bell notification thing. I want to all you missing out on the new videos, man. Come on, click. <laughs> We're here in Cleveland, Ohio. This is the West Side Market. Open Monday and Wednesday, 7 to 4, Friday and Saturday, 7 to 6. Oh, open on a Sunday. Hey, I'm hearing fun snaps. Go inside and see what's going on here. Hold on. I've seen mango over here. Oh, where? Look at that. How are you doing, partner? What's up? How are you doing, man? Good, man. Good. They used to have spices and stuff, too. There's not a lot of people here. This lady bigger than this one. Yeah, man! Look at this. What a man! Okay. Some nice kale, boy. Look at this. Hmm. Green broccoli. Cilantro. Oh, nice selection of mushrooms. Broccolini. Yeah, I got a cold wine. Actually, got uh, allergies happening big time. That's a nice fruit, but the one that caught my eye is a dragon fruit here. They got the color of the inside, boy. It's really nice. The fake. Cherries. I'm just looking right now, thank you. Well, filming. But um, some nice okra here. Well, look at the green tomatoes. I'm good right now, thank you. Hey boy, everybody friendly outside, they try to hustle. It's one or the other, it's a combination. Hustle and um, everything is stacked up eye level as well. Like, look at these grapes. I do apologize about my nose, but I can't help it. My nose are really bad this year. Hey, sir. I come in and find all over here. Chicago, chat. The wild in it, baby. Huh? Huh? Yes. What is this one? Ginep. I was hoping you'd have a different name for it. I don't think that why you touching this shit, eh? You notice you already getting on. Yeah. Love these grips, boy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, please, thank you. Yep. How you doing? Would you like to try some fresh mango? Yeah, I can take your fit. And your stem. Thank you. <laughs> Dehydrated vegetables and fruits. The lighting is not good.
sure he's a massive boy. I don't know if you guys saw my um, Serbia video, but these peppers were everywhere in Serbia, man. I love these peppers over there. You can get three baskets. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry. Hello, it's Up there. Russian sprouts. Here, ma'am, try this for you. <laughs> Some big ginger. Is it? You can get all the, uh, the different type of noodles, rice noodles, sobe noodles. Um, what else we got here? Barley. Dried mushrooms. Hey, that's the black garlic, eh? Yeah. Black rice as well, too. people in the outer. This is the main street here. We came through the back and the back of the market is where the parking is and I believe it's a dollar an hour if memory serves me right. There's a beautiful little park across the street there, live music. It's kind of nice. It's very vibrant out here. Going over to the other side of the market now because that side seems to all be about fruits let's see what they got over here oh this side is bigger friends cook food friends brought i think that's the video oh what's this fine fruits Jesus, boy. Gouda with garlic and basil. I've never seen nanny good Gouda. <laughs> Drunken good with him, mother. Steak stuff primer was $10.99 a pound. That's too expensive. And that's $10.99 USD. I'm getting that one in Canada for, I believe, oh, that actually go tomorrow. You can get it for about $7.99 a pound. Make it hard, right? Double smoked bacon. Perch, Carolina catfish, tilapia. Ooh, look at that piece of bass. That is a piece of meat, boy. Look at that piece of sea bass there. Massive, eh? We Instagram, right? Eh? Is 
Oh, big turkey wings, boy. Turkey wings, two seventy nine a pound. That's not bad, I guess. I don't know what prices are like in the U.S. typically, but Canadian standard, that's not bad. Oh, look at that, the smoky cone. Get a little grab and go. With the cheese in here. A knockwurst. Why does it have to be that color, though? That needs some color in that, man. An Amish ham. How does that differ? YouTube, if you guys know the difference between an Amish ham and a regular ham, please, please leave me a comment down below. I'd love to learn. So we've got maple brown sugar, garlic, beef, pineapple teriyaki, honey barbecue, pepper cheese, jalapeno, toast, pepper. Yeah, burn your bottom for sure. A lot of jerky and all that too, right? Garlic ham is looking good. I mean bacon, garlic bacon. It's gotta be one of the leanest pork belly I've ever seen. It's not bad in the tiny little ribs. And a baby pig and cook kill there, boy. 429 I found for wings. That's that's expensive, I would think. Well, I've seen it all. Necks and backs. I thought it was only Caribbean. We mashed that up. I love chicken foot too. No, I don't think so. Thank you. A heart. That's a steak right there, boy. Eleven dollars a pound, though. How big that is? I'm good, thank you. New. We've got salted cashews, sorted pistachios, cinnamon, almond, pecans, walnuts. Even more cheese. Quite an assortment of cheese out here, boy. Oh, a lot of Wisconsin stuff, too. Oh, look at that. Canada, black diamond in the hoozo. This is the largest selection of hummus I've ever seen. 14 spices, sriracha, chipotle, tobono, rosemary, dill, buffalo hummus, kalamata, artichoke, cilantro, lime, chocolate. Um, this is a roasted meat. This one is a cilantro jalapeno. Uh, just plain old hummus, a horseradish hummus. Yep, we're still going. Turmeric and carrots. Caramelized onion, baby gaganoush, baba ganoush. Where did I get baby out of that? A scallion hummus. Oh. Sweet roasted red pepper, lemon, tomato, basil, artichoke, dill pickle, roasted garlic, and the original hummus. Bam! Got it. Chorizo, apple chicken sausage, mild Italian. Oh, rub to the bread now. It's all kind of nice breads here. Is it like on, the, on a side wall in the middle? So we've got ciabatta, parme, parmesano, farm, rustic Italian, multi green baguette, and it goes on. Oh, look at these. It's like a pizza bagel, man. 
Where? What is that? Oh, zones, boy. And back to the bread again. Sourdough and whatnot and whatnot. Parmesan pepper, cranberry pecan, pecan raisin. What we got here? Oh, cupcakes. And cookies. Chala. Try that stuff hey, chicken wing. How are you? I get one of your stuffed chicken wings, please. Would you like heat it up? Yeah, please, if you don't mind. The regular one or the lamb grass and peanut flavor? Which is better? <laughs> uh, some people like the regular. If you like curry, the curry is good too. I'll go with the regular. Thank you. So this is the stuffed chicken one here. And with a little dipping sauce to go with it. Alright, let's try this. I know she might wait it, so I'm a bit scared right now to try it immediately, but we'll see. Oh look at that. That's almost like a boudin, the rice sausage we have in the Caribbean. But I'm over. Blood pudding. Chocolate covered pretzels, worms. We've got candy central here, bro. Candied apples. Oh, look at all the macaroons, bro. Let's go around and see if we can see some more. Wow, look at the size of those cream puffs. Noles, tiramisu, lemon squares, New York style cheesecake. Mm -hmm. Some nice turtle boy. What the hell are these noodles? Pardon? Yeah. Well, it wouldn't hurt. Wouldn't hurt. Strawberry chocolate chip, pistachio, peanut butter, white chocolate, double chocolate, s'mores. Yeah. 
interesting stuff here, like this Italian stuffed patties there, the seven layer stuffed pepper. But these ones, the pork chops. I understand it's smoke on the apple, but crushed orange, the Louisiana Bloody Mary, a Dr. Pepper, an Asian restaurant chops. Passion fruit? I don't know, man. One more here, too. A lot of these smokies, boy. Um, what caught my eye is these enchiladas. So you got portobello, zucchini, and corn, spinach, and potato, black bean, shredded pork loin. Poor porkita pig. Didn't make it. I hope. Somebody's gonna enjoy you, yeah, buddy. Make some nice head cheese or something out of you. An assortment, an assortment of hot sauces. Heartbreaking dogs. Angry, angry cock hot, angry <laughs> cock hot dog. Oh boy. Wow, even more over here. A whiskey River, Galic Habanero, Cleveland. It's interesting. Curry sauce. Who buys curry sauce, right? I don't know, not me. How you doing? Oh wow, there's even more down here, boy. Look at all the hot sauces. Hey, my toques. My toques made an appearance. Oh, nice. Look at them now. Sure enough, here in Chicago. Uh, where were we? No, we're in Cleveland. Yeah. Why do I keep saying Chicago? Like, I can ask Chippewa. Um, do they have a snack? Here we go. Lake Erie walleye. White bass from Lake Erie. There's a bass on. Oh, yeah. White bass. I didn't realize there's a white bass in Lake Erie. Catfish. You see that pink fish there? That is your niceness. What caught my eye is this red silk snapper. That is truly something to look at. Bro. See this big American red snapper there? I'd have some fun with that for sure. That red grouper over there too. There's some beautiful seafood here. Oysters, prawns. Now, in case you haven't figured it out yet, we were there back, I think it would have been late June, early July in Cleveland. That is 2019. So the year is wrapping up now, but we were there during the summer months. Um, number one, the people at the market, outside the market, just everybody we encountered was super friendly, willing to share stories and, and, and just outgoing. You know, we met a lady there with her two boys. And we were upstairs at this point overlooking the entire market. And she told us a story about the, the, the history of the market and how long she's been coming and how it's sort of a, a tradition with her and her boys to come out and just snack at the market. Number two, the, 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 the ingredients and in, in from the, the meats to the fish to the vegetables to the fruit, super fresh, super um of, of great quality and the abundance of variety of it man i saw ingredients there like the chenato get up as the, the guy said the dragon fruit the mangoes the, that's all stuff that we eat in the caribbean man and here we are in cleveland with top quality stuff like that truly amazing and three the entire vibe not just the market i went outside we went outside we sat on a patio that, that whole sort of core area there, it is truly, 
um, a, a wonderful place to just spend the morning or an afternoon or something. You know, you grab something from the market, you go outside, there was live music being played, and there's all these um, craft breweries and all that stuff there. Real nice, man. Little side note, though, no samples. What kind of market have no samples? But when you asked, supposedly the lady told us, well, if you asked, you will get samples. So that's a little tip. Ask and maybe they'll hook you up with a sample or two. Chrissy at CaribbeanPod.com. Always a pleasure having you guys along with us on Galavanting. If you know of a spot we should check out, down in the comment down there, hit me a little note or two. Remember that thumbs up, click subscribe, and check out CaribbeanPod.com if you want to cook something nice for your family. All right? <laughs>